Brown, uh, Cessna 919 Tango Charlie, run up complete at the Delta ramp. Cessna 9 Tango Charlie, run line 17 right at the Charlie, taxi via Papa Charlie. Hi folks, on this flight there were several objectives on the test card. The primary ones were wing level stalls and to calibrate the Garmin angle of attack functionality. Secondary ones were to try to characterize what is happening with the ADS-BN. Um, I wasn't receiving traffic information on the first two flights, so this one was to try to, to, try to narrow down what's going on. Uh, another secondary objective was to keep the power at 75% as much as possible to keep breaking in the engine. Tower Cessna 919 Tango Charlie, uh, run up to the Delta. You said taxi to 17 right, correct? Cessna 9 Tango Charlie, I firm run 17 right at Charlie via Papa Charlie. Pop Charlie. Echo clear for takeoff, right turn. Clear for takeoff, 17 right, echo intersection, right turn, 437 echo. Hooks Tower Experimental, 14 Lima Charlie, ready to go, 17 right on Charlie. 14 Lima Charlie, Hooks Tower Roger, stand by. 14 Lima Charlie, stand by. Fully when Charlie wants right, Charlie clear for immediate takeoff. Shop going one mile final. Let's do it. Get it up and go. <laughs> Roger that. One for Lima Charlie clear for immediate takeoff. Six Echo Charlie, do me a favor. Give me a right turn westbound now. Right turn westbound. 86 Echo Charlie. Charlie, remain out of below 1,200 westbound. Remaining below 1,000 westbound, 86 Echo Charlie. 14 Lima Charlie, sorry, runway heading for now. Runway heading, 14 Lima Charlie. Check canopy. 437 Echo, you keep it in, either go high or keep it in low. The check canopy warnings uh, that you're hearing there are false alarms. I checked, I verified that it was closed. After the flight, I, I noticed that the switch was being kind of intermittent, and I think I fixed that. Check canopy. Check I just need this one down around the pattern. I can take either side. I'm ready to come back in. 437 Echo. 437 Echo, Roger. That's 1-7 right, number one. Clear to land. Clear to land, 1-7 right. We're going Check to hotel. 437 Echo. Roger that. And the long land is approved for 437 Echo. And hook tower 45394 is uh, with you on the visual 1-7 right. I'm calling Hux Tower, say again, please. Uh, four flight 394 with you on the visual 17 right. Mm -hmm. Four flight 394, Hux Tower, continue inbound 17 right. Hux, continue inbound 17 uh, right, four flight 394. 6199 Bravo, verify squawk in 1200. Uh, we are now, sorry about that, sir. And number uh, 14, Lehman Charlie, what was your on course heading? 1-4 Lima Charlie is going northwest. 1-4 Lima Charlie, Roger, give me that right turn northwest now. Right turn northwest now, 1-4 Lima Charlie. 3 0 one, one, seven, one, seven, right number 2, clear to land, traffic, you file now, just open the numbers. 1-7 right, clear to land number 2, for 3 0 one, one, seven. 4 flight 3 9 one, you number 2 to follow Warrior, correction number 3 to follow Warrior on a 2 mile final, we're one seven right, number 2 now, clear to land. Alright, clear to land number 2, 4 flight 3 nine, four. Okay, here I am at uh, 5,000 feet and about to do some stalls. 5374, 2847. Hooks Tower, left flight 35, south 800, left flight pass. 553, Hooks Tower, right direction to left flight pass. I'm doing a risk, use caution on the moon area. Left flight to do this with no flaps. Uh, let me think. Yeah, no flaps. Okay, so that's the regular stall horn. It goes off at 76 with no flaps, looks like. I'm getting down to 65. Hopefully it won't stall.
Ten two zero zero at four gust one nine. So when you see me up there playing with the primary flight display, I'm fiddling with the angle of attack calibration. Number two eight four Alpha flight due west on the score your face upon for me, please. Could you repeat that? Now I'm gonna stall. Alpha. Number two eight four six Alpha. There goes the stall Fly right there. Westbound, turning heading two seven zero. Just square your base to final. That didn't sound right. So that was 64 knots with no flaps, and I can't remember what I was thinking about when I said it didn't sound right. I'll go two notches of flaps. Oh, and none of this is really an attempt to demonstrate proper stall recovery technique. That's not the mission here. Zero three pick up the up and aircraft about a uh, three fourths of a mile behind you. Right turn to Echo and take it all the way to Echo to park and monitor ground. Have a good day. Local exiting Echo, monitor ground, take it back to the Four two whiskey, two quick land, one seven right. Two to land, one seven right, four two whiskey. Okay, I wasn't really paying attention. I think that was probably about fifty five. Four seven, make that left turn to the numbers now. So there's a huge difference between no flaps and, and flaps. Probably four seven, seven make that left turn to the numbers now. So that was a that was a sixty four knots with no flaps, and then fifty five knots with two notches of flaps, which is in this plane is uh, twenty degrees of flaps. And then also the uh, the brake with uh, with two notches of flaps is a bit more pronounced than no flaps. Now zero four zero two. I want you to enter runway one smart from Charlie. Make that right turn and back tack. Okay. Number six six five star. Turn left base now. Turn left base six six five star. Four two whiskey exit. Where you got parking at? Looks is a really busy airport. I have no idea why I had the tower on this whole time while I was doing this testing, but in a few, couple of minutes you'll notice I turn it down all the way. Okay, there's a and two. Charlie, Charlie, turn right, heading three zero zero. Maintain two thousand one seven right at Charlie. Clear for takeoff. Okay. Four zero kilo. Make that one eighty. Put power. Okay, I'm going to do it at uh, full flaps this time. Now, 4 0 kilo, one right, Charlie, clear for takeoff. Christian, one seven right, clear for takeoff. There's a lot of nose down. One nine six six five seven one seven right, clear for the option. One seven right, clear for the option. Six six five five. Number six single X-ray, you're following the Warrior now, pushing three miles straight in final, doing 80 knots over the ground. If you can't reduce to 100 at least ground speed, let me know. That's the mechanical okay. stall horn. Number four, six alpha, I need you to increase your speed if possible, 10 knots. Increasing 10 knots, four, six alpha. Station two, Charlie, Charlie, contact Houston departure, one out of point seven, have a good flight, guys. 55, all centered, 54, Number six, single x-ray, thank you guys so much for that. You number two to follow Warrior 52. on a two, that's correct. Number three to follow and Warrior on a two. 50, 51 and a half, about. All right, one seven right, number three, clear And a slight break to the left, but not bad. And I need to fix that, because that's going off at 80. That's ridiculous. Okay, now... Seven, five, four, seven. Four, seven, number two to follow that Cessna is doing touch and go. One, go down one notch. That's 10 degrees. And back to see where we stall. Sixty-three, sixty-two, sixty-one, and. The little chevrons are saying we're getting close, and I feel a little bit of buffet, and there's a stall at 60. So 
with one notch of flaps. And give it a little power. Give it a second notch. So that's down to, let's see, that's 20%. And we'll do the same thing again. So angle of attack is showing, let's see, we've got 65 drop power. There's the first morning chevron. 57, 56, and there's some buffet. And the chevron's saying we're about to stall. AOA is, and we're just mushing, I think. Cover. So I'm going to call that 57 with 20 degrees of flaps. And then we'll go again with full flaps just to repeat the results. And we're getting a fair amount of, a lot of nose down pitch. And I'm trimming it out. And then here we go again for another stall. Fifty-five, some buffet, and fifty-two. There's the break. A little bit off to the right. I mean, to the left. So fifty-two with three notches of flaps. I don't know if you could hear what I was saying over all of that racket. So I think that's mission accomplished for today's flight, so I'm going to head back. I need to lose some altitude. Yeah, we're doing on fuel. Five hundred. Not sure why I'm hearing uh, two enunciations for five hundred. Need to figure that one out. Still don't have the angle of attack showing up. Um, Tower, Archer 450 Alpha Alpha, nine miles to the northeast. I'd like to transition the airspace from the northeast to the southwest to about 1800. Number 450 Alpha Alpha, Hook Star, Squawk 5355, five, correction 5333, three, three, and transition is approved. 5333, three, three, and appreciate the transition. 450 Alpha Alpha. Okay, why is the AOA just now showing up? That was kind of sloppy. 141 Charlie, we got sparking that today. Uh, T hangers, 141 Charlie. 141 Charlie, exit Echo, Tax Park via Echo Juliet, Echo Papa, your discretion, monitor ground. Uh, taxi parking, Echo Juliet, uh, and monitor ground, 141 Charlie. And number 83 Lima Charlie, Roy 171 Charlie, cleared for takeoff, left turn to the northeast is approved. All right, what's up, right? Cleared for takeoff and left turn northeast. Altimeters two nine or nine or nine or wind one six zero at one zero gust two one. I think I need to have another session with the angle of attack uh, gauge or whatever you want to call it, because um, I did 
all of that stuff with, or not all of it, but a lot of it with no flaps, and I think that dramatically changes the results, and that, that makes complete sense. So I think I want it to work um, in the most common landing configuration. Oops, I forgot to monitor ground. There, now I am. That's okay. That was a good flight. Good, uh, good getting used to the airplane. And it's hotter than hell in here now. It's amazing. It was seven degrees out here. What is that sound? Also, popping sound in the back. I think it's the something's too rich. Well, I also hope I got point nine in there because uh, that's what I need for to get this insurance on the plane. They want to see five hours of flight time, and I on this plane, even though I have four hundred something on an RV eight, but they want five hours so uh, for insurance. So I was at four point one. <laughs> 